would you ever do uh like that polar bear thing like jump into the the frozen hole in the ice or whatever that sounds really really any of you any of you i'm sorry uh (laughs) i think i would i think especially if it was like a supervised group thing if it was just me giving it a go like as a fuck about i i I would really like to do it um are you uh, naked when you do it I, I, mean, I, I am. You do I, you. Yeah, I was. Yeah. I was about to say. Um, I, I'm going to wear some shorts. Uh, I think, as George Casanza would say, there will be significant shrinkage uh, when I come out of the uh, the frozen lake. Um, I'm going to be peacocking. People do that in Vancouver on testicles. January first. <laughs> I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to alpha everyone there by coming out of it totally erect. <laughs> so <laughs> on January on January first. So, so like, I don't know how cold will go running into the ocean. And it's like a polar bear swim. Is that a New York thing? Uh, it was happen? in Vancouver. It was in Vancouver. I've been That's in cold legit. water twice. I've, I've been in water that had ice frozen over it. I fell through the ice before and got completely Ooh, soaked. That sucks. I've done that. I've done that. Uh, it's not as like bad as it sounds. I was in like a frozen swamp. So like falling through the ice just meant that you like got soaked in water. There was like, no, you weren't going to drown or anything. You were probably up to like thigh level, like not full but body, I, right? But the problem is like, I was flat on my stomach trying to like not go through the ice. <laughs> so I just went, so, so it like broke like, and the part where my feet had gone through was lower and this big sheet of ice did this and I slid like slowly and the, and the water was also, the water's like coming up as the whole thing slinks down and mm-hmm. I'm just like slowly realizing that I might as well start crawling through the water because we are soaked and it's like two miles back to my friend's house. My dick disappeared. <laughs> Dude, I have a similar thing. <laughs> so I'm in middle school. And there's a pond that's frozen over. It's a small pond that doesn't get deep enough to drown. And it's frozen over, which in New Jersey is not an all the time thing. It's like a, it happens, but it's it's nice. So we start playing on it. And we realize that it's thick enough to walk on kind of carefully most mm-hmm. of the time, but not so thick that you can be careless. Yeah. And I mean, I've always been stupid. So we like play with the edges of how strong it is, how much you can jump put a hole in it here and see what happens when you start walking near the hole until eventually, of course we fall in, Mm -hmm. fall in this frozen pond. And then we realize, you know what? This isn't that bad. So we start like, now there's like big shelves of ice and we're standing on them and they're all tippy and slippery and shit. We're falling in this frozen pond repeatedly. We do this for like two hours, just <laughs> fucking around with the frozen pond. And we're Jerry about a, died. <laughs> we're about a mile from home, so we walk home cold and wet. And I had a middle school dance that night. I I had lost my voice by the time the dance was that. I showed up with like laryngitis, just like horsing at girls asking can't you dance with me <laughs> no <laughs> you dance with me yeah. what's wrong with you <laughs> i was fucking around a frozen lake and then <laughs> yeah that began a long string of uh romantic failures the other time <laughs> the other time i went into cold water was when we were filming that stupid uh video for um act of valor oh yeah yeah I don't know. So we filmed that in January. So I don't know how cold it was that day, but I would guess it was in the high 40s, low 50s. I don't know how cold the water was, but God damn, it was cold. God damn, it was cold. And I had to go under that fucking water. And I just I got in and Scott's standing there with that fucking camera and I'm, I'm, I'm hyperventilating in the water and I'm looking up at him. I'm like, I only want to I only want I only want to do this shit fucking once. So fuck this up. Start recording now. I don't want you to have to hit that button. I want you forgetting. All right. I'm gonna go under the fucking water. When I come up, you you pan and you pan and zoom. All right. Pan and zoom. And just stay on me until I say, "All right, don't fuck this up." And like I have to I go under that fucking water, and then I I have to now I have to go into like I'm not cold pretend mode. <laughs> and I say my nonsense, and then like. I, ha- I needed help getting out of my clothes because they were like suctioned to me and soaking wet. And I had on all this tactical bullshit. And so like I'm I'm laying on the ground and there's a man on each of my pants legs and my pants are going <laughs> as they're pulling them off of me. I'd have fucking died if they'd left me in that field on my home. Like, like If so they weren't cold. that cold in the movie, that wasn't part of it. It was just they- cold. The, they were in a fucking jungle. They were in a swamp yeah, or something. Like Vietnam or something. But I needed a body of water to like 
like rise up up ninja right. style. I saw and, the video. Yeah. Well, fucking, I'm sorry. This conversation is not, not just for me. Kyle, that's, that's I already fair. know. It's just oh. us talking. That's right. I've told you this all before. <laughs> um yeah that that was awful i don't like being in the cold water but i would do the polar bear thing because that's like i feel like there's like warmth immediately you know afterwards and you're good to go what do you gain by do you just jump in i think it's just a shock. I think it's just fun. yeah yeah, yeah i think fun. some people feel like uh it wakes them up in an interesting way yeah it's exhilarating i mean i don't those even want to take cold showers cold showers are too those are for psychotics they are they're for insane people if you take a cold shower you're an absolute psychopath Really? You don't do it now and then? Never. No, I, I, I love I love piping hot shower. I like it just to the point that I can barely stand it. That's here's where what I like my shower. Here's what I do. My wife this, this is another one of my stupid things I do. Um at the end and because I heard that uh hot water makes your pores open. And so if you take a hot shower and you come out like I, I feel like that makes you more acne prone. I feel like your pores are open and then they're more likely to get clogged. Uh. Um, oh, you don't so think I, open allows them to unclog? I don't think that ever happens. And I, I, I think those commercials are bullshit. When like the, the Biore like goes down in and gets a bunch of go- and that that never happened once. The uh, the but <laughs> I don't get acne. I've got that Accutane shield. Yeah, I know you do. everybody else has gets acne though. So like I, at the end of my shower, what I do is I slowly go a little cold, more and more and more. And if you do it really slowly like that, and you rotate so that every part of your body is getting accustomed, mm. you can slowly get to an almost frigid shower and not even mind too much. But but you have to go slow. And so I do that at the end of my showers. like like Because I, I, what I do is I, t- I take a bath and then a shower every day, at least once a day, usually twice a day, because I got to soak my hair for an hour. And then you know, I take a shower after the soak. You got to soak that hair for an hour. Yeah, I soak the hair for an hour. I I need the Epsom salt bath too. I I I like to be in there, um, you know, getting all salty. No, when I'm taking a shower, like my body is like visibly more red when I get out. Yeah, because I it's it's borderline boiling. It's almost steam coming out of the shower. You want the temperature right below flesh damage. Yes, and sometimes sometimes right at flesh damage (laughs) (laughs) because that that gives a nice. I want to burn. Harley, are you a hot shower man? Very hot. I type. am. I am a very hot. Like I'm like damage my hair and skin type hot. Jeez. Same. Yeah. Like I come out and like I fucking accidentally dry my face with the jizz towel and get four pimples. <laughs> <laughs>